What was the most important thing? And I think this is a lesson for young quarterbacks. What was the most important thing that you did then that helped you become the player that you are? Um, I think it was, uh, I mean, there's a lot of things you do. And it's it's really, I think it's respecting the game and, 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 and uh, working at it, working at your profession and uh, listening, you know, uh, you know, Don Strock was my backup for Don a few Strzok. years. Remember Don Strock, right? Strzok I mean, I come in and wow. I couldn't get enough information from that guy. It's like I followed him around. I was like a little kid yeah. following him, Virginia him around. Tech, man. Yeah, exactly. Wow. Yeah, yeah, man. He played with my father. He was oh, my, yeah. father, he was my father's quarterback. <laughs> yeah, you are getting old, Marino. Oh, man. All right. <laughs> I lost, yeah, I lost track now. I don't know what, what I was talking about. <laughs> yeah, Don Strock. Uh, yeah, so you know, I was like a little kid following him around, just trying to get as much information as I can. And I, I, I think it, it was the fact that if you have talent, Talent and I, you know, obviously they felt like I had talent because I was a first-round pick. Yeah. And then you work hard at it, and you're around good people. It's going to give you a chance to be successful. You know, the that's other, really what it is. I'm sorry, Dan. The other end of that equation is that that aging quarterback isn't always so willing to help the young stud. <laughs> Did Don Strock want to help you? Oh yeah, no, right off okay. the bat, I All went right. and asked okay. him. Yeah, yeah. Don was, you know, he's a true friend now, and he was great then too. So, so do you yeah. think it's a disservice? The expectation we throw on some of these young kids. Yeah, don't look, play they right look now. They're pretty good, though. Well, some, because some the way them, it is. Some of them do well right? yes, in, yep, in, that, yep. in that play right now, you know, formula. But a lot of them don't. And it's all who's around them, who's what team, who's their coaches. I mean, all that's part of it. And the expectations are high because, you know, you're picking a kid number one, number two overall in a draft, and you expect them to produce right away. And that's that's just part of it. And if you're going to be really good at what you do, you accept that role and you and, and just do whatever you can to be successful. 